We are at the API reference of the Jest object, and now let's talk about the mock functions. So the fn method returns a new unused mock function, and you can also pass an implementation to this function if you want. Okay, so here it's creating mock function, it's calling it, and it is checking if this mock function has been called. And here we have an implementation that always returns true, and here we just console log the true value. The isMock function checks if a function is a mock function or not. So here I have a common function and it's false, it's the return of this mock function is false and here I have a mock function and the return of the ismock function is true. The spy on is similar to js.fn but also track the calls when you get the object the property by the name. Okay, so here we're getting, the, we're passing the video object to the spy on, and also we're passing the property we want to spy, and it stores this spied method inside the spy variable, and here we're calling the play, and with the spy we can check if this play method has been called. And here it is just restoring the state, so this video play will be won't be mocked anymore. So we can also use the check if the ismock function okay so at this point the video play is a mock function because it is been spied by the spy on but after we restore it the video play is not a mock function anymore it has been restored you can pass the access type if you want to spy on a getter or a setter Okay, so here we have a video with a play method, with a get method actually, with a get play, 
in a audio we have a set volume and a get volume in here at the first spy we are spying on the video play but with the get accessor on the volume we are passing the set because we're spying on the set volume of the audio The clear all mocks clear all the mocks and it is equivalent of the mock clear but for every mocked function. Okay, so here I have the function that returns 42 and at this point I expect it to have been called one time but after I clear the mocks I expect it not to have been called. When you clear all the mocks the implementation still remains there so I, if I call it again it, the result will be 42 as expected. The reset all mocks is equivalent of calling mock reset to all the mocks and the reset mocks clears also the implementation of the mock so if I try to run like this it will break at this point and yes because it's returning undefined not 42 because it cleared also the implementation The restore all mocks is equivalent of calling mock restore on every mock function. Okay, so here I'm spying on the video play and on the audio increase volume and before I call the restore all mocks, all those two functions will be a mock function and after I restore, if I call the isMock function again, it is 
false, is really false. 